October 22, 2005, this two-year-old Shizu came in with this uh, itchy ears. Now you can see that the whole ear is uh, pigmented. My no, whole whole ear pigmented. It's pigmented. We have already clipped off the hairs and uh, irrigated the ears and uh, took a ear swap and for bacterial culture the smell is a vinegar smell now you notice this part is black and uh, the, the owner says a few months of scratching it become black and she applies some uh, commercial ointment commercial drops onto it so this could be an allergy as well. Now we look at the other side, the other ear. We turn the dog over. And the same thing. Same pigmentation also in this ear. Now we take a cotton bud and see anymore. We check again. Now the dog is under sedation and has the ear has been irrigated. And uh, we will check and see. Yeah, those are the black discharge. So other than that, I'm looking for scabies. Hold the head first. Uh, there's no crusty edges. There's no crusty edges here. So unlikely to be scabies. Now this is a very rare case of a young dog with with uh, pigmented pigmented ears. Shih Tzu, two years old, inflamed and pigmented ears. Now this looks very much like an allergy to the the ear drops, commercial ear drops applied by the owner for self treatment for several months until uh, she has to consult the vet. Now you can see we can open the mouth, open the mouth, and see the teeth is very white. So this is confirmed to be to be two years old. Wait, see the tongue. It's a two-year-old Shih Tzu. So normally two years old, this ear problem has been caught for a long time. Now we take a scalpel blade and do a, a, a scraping and see there. So maybe take one new scalpel blade there. I give to me I do. Just you just video for me. Just checking for scabies or, or demodex. Thank you. 